Hello again. Most of us will see some wet and windy weather over the weekends, but uh, for many today, at least fine and bright with some sunshine around. It's a little bit on the chilly side and that's not completely dry. There are a few showers, particularly across the west. And we'll keep a few showers for parts of Wales, southwest England, western parts of Scotland and a sprinkling just moving through Northern Ireland. So also a bit of snow on the mountains across Scotland, but for many central and eastern parts, dry and fine. Certainly a big improvement compared to yesterday across the southeast. A bit breezy in the southwest, but generally the winds are quite light, which means although it is chilly, temperatures uh, below average in single figures, if you get in that sunshine with those light winds, it shouldn't feel too bad this Friday afternoon. Through Friday evening, a few more showers drift across northern Scotland, but generally the showers tend to fizzle away. For many, it'll be dry and clear, and we could see a, a touch of frost for a time across the east, uh, but notice clouds spilling in from the west, turning damp and drizzly around western coasts and particularly wet in western Scotland as we start the weekend. As I said, there could be some pockets of frost for a time, and first thing in the morning still, where well, we've got the clearest skies across East Anglia and the southeast in rural areas, temperatures could be close to freezing, but generally temperatures rising as we go through the night. It is going to turn milder this weekend, but it is also going to be fairly cloudy. A lot of cloud around on Saturday morning, Bar a bit of drizzle across the east, though, and some rain over the mountains and hills uh, across western parts. Most of England and Wales will be dry for most of Saturday. But the uh, same could not be true uh, for parts of western Scotland and Northern Ireland. Here we are going to see that rain moving in, the winds picking up, and um, some quite heavy bursts of rain likely across western Scotland. So with the higher temperatures, that's going to melt some snow over the mountains, and this extra rain falling could then cause a few issues. That's something to keep an eye on. Temperature-wise, well, as I said, it is turning milder, so by the afternoon, double digits quite widely. And if we see any brighter spells, which we could see a bit of blue sky to the uh, north and east of hills and mountains, well, that'll feel quite pleasant. But the winds, again, picking up and getting quite gusty, and uh, the rain also pepping up and moving into parts of northwest England and Wales. Brighter colours here, most of it falling over the mountains, but of course, sensitive areas here after such a wet February, the potential that that also could cause some issues. So again, uh, something that needs to be watched. Also we're getting very blustery through Saturday evening and overnight. It stays fairly gusty on Sunday. Sunday's a more straightforward day. It's kind of sunny spells, yes, but also plenty of showers. Be lucky to stay completely dry, but most of the showers will be across the west. Uh, for the very latest weather details, make sure you stay up to date. Best way to do that is to follow us on social media.